Do you have children? A son? A daughter? I do. Two little girls. Snowed the day my wife died. Her heart gave out. Sam found her. She... She passed in her sleep. We buried her so the boys wouldn't have to see her like that. The snow... It covered her grave. We raced it. Like she'd never been there at all. I'm really sorry for your loss. Thank you. I've tried to focus on our kids, but the past, it always seems to find you. Ever since Sophia, I've tried to keep our family from home, but we're falling apart, piece by piece. And now that Sam's hurt, and Greg's... I could really use your help. Your friend Pete told me all about Norma, about what happened. If she finds us, we wouldn't stand a chance. But you seem like someone who can hold their own. <sighs> Children shouldn't have to see this. Greg never turned into one of these things, did he? Or those... whatever they are. No, he was Greg until the end. Thank God. I... I'm sorry. I'm trying to keep it together. But what if you just found out your daughters were dead? And you weren't there. You were miles away, safe and sound. How would you feel? Your kids need you to stay strong. You, you're right. I'm all they have. Peekaboo. Motherfucker. This is bad. This is bad. Why is that side red? Well, I'd rather take out the guy with the gun. I'll take the one near the fountain. Getting a little nervous there, buddy. Yeah, you should be nervous. Because you are about to die. Oh my gosh!
Well, isn't that a load of shit? Just blew his head clean off. Off me. God, Michonne is vicious. I would hate to get on her bad side. Can only get worse from here. Oh shit! You must be pretty proud of yourself, huh? Cut yourself a golden goose. If you think I'm shitting any eggs, forget it. Jesus! Whoa! You don't mess around. <laughs> I like that. Does Norma know we're here? She doesn't even know I'm here. Otherwise, you'd be hearing a neighborly knock on your door right about now. Randall? Randall, are you getting this? You, uh, want to get that for me? We heard gunshots. If you don't check in, I'm sending everyone in that direction. Shit. She sounds pissed. Randall, pick up, goddammit. You gonna answer? Talk to her, Michelle. Don't make the same mistake again. Where the hell are you? Yeah! Randall! Tell her my hands if I stump, and I've swallowed a pint of my own blood. Yeah. I got a few words for her. Let's talk through this, Norma. We can figure it out. Michelle, you ought to kill several of my people so we're not starting off on a good foot. <clears throat> Where's my brother? Go on. Tell her. Don't spare any of the gory details. Call off your people, Norma. We can get to that, but there's something we gotta clear up first. I want the truth on this. You hear me? Did you hurt him? If you so much as breathed on my brother, I'll find you and make what happened on the ferry look like a goddamn picnic! That's a fucking guarantee! Randall shot an innocent man in the head. Anything I did to him, he deserved. What Randall did, that was a mistake. I'll make sure he knows it. But I'll punish him, not you. Okay, 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 okay. Let's wind this down a bit. If you've had his walkie-talkie the whole time, then you already know. We heard the shots, we know where you are. But if you let Randall go, 
Maybe we can all walk away. Randall is the only family I have, and I'm not leaving him behind. One way or the other. You want him? He's yours. But then you can leave us the fuck alone. Be reasonable, Michonne. That's all I ask. We'll be there soon. You know, this alone time, you and me together, it's been real nice. But that all ends when my sister gets here. I'm gonna take that wrench and break your skull. And then Sam's and yours. And last but not least, those kitties too. I saw their little heads in the window. Kids, you know, their skulls don't break so much as kind of melt. Jeez! Jeez! Michonne. Well, hey now. Don't you two look like your daddy? Back when he still had a face. <laughs> what? Yeah. Got a big hole there now. Sean, is that true? Please tell me he's fucking with us. Please. There was nothing I could do, Sam. No. 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 <laughs> James! <laughs> if he killed my dad, then why isn't this son of a bitch dead? First good question asked all night. Michonne's just been fumbling around like a bear cub fucking a football. Randall has more value if he's alive. Gives us something to bargain with when Norma gets Listen here. Listen to me! That won't work! They only bargain with bullets. All she wants is her brother back. That's it. We're out of the equation. You need to kill him, or I will. Sam, wait! No matter what I say, you're just gonna do whatever you want anyway. I know you've already made up your mind. I ain't had the bell of the ball. Well, maybe that's you. Because when this dance is over, you're fucked. Kill me, and Norma hunts you down until you're all dead. Fucked! Let me live, and I do even worse. Fucked. But we both know how this is gonna end, Michonne. You like killing. And you'd like killing me, wouldn't you? Just tell old Randall the truth. I got thick skin. You won't hurt my feelings. I'm sure you'd like to see me dead, too. If it's in the cards. Or maybe, maybe you think you can rise above all that. And if there ain't no heaven up there, honey, there ain't no hell down below. There's only this shit every day until you die. Then you know what's the fucking kicker? You get up and keep walking. If you got a point, get to it already. On my way, darling. This this is the world your kids are dying in, Michelle. <gasps> or dying in, or are in that walking purgatory. Shut up. Don't talk about that. Either way, they're suffering. 
And mommy isn't there. We all have our demons, honey. Some are on the inside. Some are sitting right in front of us, wondering what kind of mother brings a child into this mess of world. There ain't no blue skies for them anymore. Yes, that means the dance is over. No, Bella. No one will be here soon. Your funeral. Where you only have your thoughts for company. And those can be mean. Nasty. You want to believe all lives and all deaths have a purpose. <laughs> believe me, they don't. It's true. Things always fall apart. But we're the ones who bring them down.